the power of the dark side, 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 side. Okay, so this is going to be a quick little project. Alright, so let's say you need some blinds. Um, but when you go down to the store, the blinds that they will cut to fit are the more expensive blinds. And uh, what I have here is a blind that costs four and a half dollars. It's all plastic. And this blind is 26 and a half inches. Well, my window happens to be right at about 26. So, instead of buying the more expensive blinds, which would be almost three times the price, and having them cut down, so they'd be like $15, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this the simple way. And now, uh, you know, this may not work if you're a fancy person, but it will certainly work for me. So, here we have the blind. We've taken it out of the box. Taken all the hardware off of it that was attached to it um, in the box. So, and taking the rod off. So we just have the blind here. And then, I've pulled the end cap off one end. I'm only going to cut one end of this. So in the window it might look a little bit off, but I've got curtains and I'm going to hope that that will be okay. But too much work to do both ends. And then you have two jagged ends, so, which we want to avoid. So we're going to sand the end here when we get done. Alright, so... We will... See if we can't set the camera up here. All right, so got the end cap here. Then we're gonna duct tape this end just to hold it tight. So. So we're cutting off about a half an inch. I should have marked it. And, but we're gonna eyeball it, which I do a lot. So if you eyeball it and get it wrong, don't complain to me. Go get your tape measure. Do as I say, not as I do. All right, now let's see. That needs to be a little better. want to get that real tight right there all right and basically we're just using a regular saw a, a hacksaw might work better but with a hacksaw I can't use the groove of my deck to do this which I want to do so we're gonna start up here starting here would be hard because of the fact that this is hollow right here Cut a little bit off of there. Just gonna cut it like a two by four. Keep in mind, I've never done this before, so we're doing it for the first time together.
take the sander. By the way, I did not look this up on YouTube or anything. Now that I'm looking at it, there's obviously going to be videos about it because it works perfectly. And then, end cap, back on. All right, so there is the side we didn't do, and then there is the side we did do. Boy, that's that works really nice. So now we'll install them and see if they fit. Okay, well, here we are. And, I mean, there's the end that we just, oh, sorry, wrong end. There is the end that we just did. So, let's see if it fits. It's gonna fit. It's not a question. Okay, will it fit over there? Uh, come on, my fingers are in the way, that's all, isn't it? Oh my God, if it doesn't fit, I'm gonna have to do it again. Oh. All right, it's just right. Just right, okay? Got just a little wiggle room there, so. Now, let us see, what do we get? Look at that, works just fine. So that's five bucks, five bucks, and that's five bucks after tax. All right, I gotta move that. So anyway, that's it. The easy way to cut your blinds with almost any saw in the house. All right, see you later.